The response has been incredible. Adam Soltani says people have already exhibited the Oklahoma standard with their generosity and that some refugees have started to embrace their new life here in a new country. And they have come forward with care, with compassion, and with kindness. Soltani says he has already been able to meet some of the refugees since they've arrived. The first arrival was a family, but I was able to meet the father of that family. Um, and he was actually able to attend a religious service at a local mosque. And they're starting to adjust to the new environment. Although I can't imagine how difficult it is leaving everything you've ever known and coming to a new place, I think we have started the process of making it a little bit easier for these families. As soon as the refugees get here, they receive welcome kits that include a copy of the Quran, a prayer rug, and PPE and hygiene items. Sultani says they're accepting donations from anyone who can give. For hygiene items, for both genders and all ages, uh, clothing, in particular modest clothing, uh, but clothing for adults and children. And that there are already volunteer groups that have come to greet the refugees upon their arrival. We have individuals from the Jewish, um, Christian, Muslim, uh, Baha'i, Buddhist, and many other faith communities that have signed up to serve as welcome committees. He says the most important thing for them is to remind the new Oklahomans that they will be accepted and can be their authentic selves. And we remind them that your faith and your culture are safe here. Now we also spoke with Catholic Charities, and they are also accepting donations and volunteers, although there is an extensive volunteer training process that you would have to complete. You can find that on their website, catholiccharitiesok.org.